hey, I've, I've named all the games I've played. Uh, but once you follow me, make sure you get on my gamer tags. Make sure if you want to play Destiny, go to there. Please head over to the YouTube if you want to see any of the things that you do. And if you want to get onto the social club for GTA, there you go. There's all my links, boys and girls. Make sure to go over and join our guild cruise. Sub, follow, like, share, view. And you can find us on Twitter at Geekly Gaming. Once I log off. Oh, he bailed like instantly. What if I were to come right back now to the show? <laughs> what if I just come back to the show and <laughs> he's like, oh, I thought he was gone. See, that's how I tested people. God, I'm just getting a while, so I'm like, hmm. I literally was like, ooh, that's going to be in the show. And he was out of this chat room in a second. You guys got to remember one big thing. There's a difference between streamers and professional Twitch post streamers. Some people just have a PS4 and or computer gaming, and they just stream for the hell of it. I stream because I'm reaching for partnership here on Twitch, because I'm doing this as a part of my income to help myself and the child. Um, which means that I have to like focus toward the greater good. Jesus Christ, I'm getting lagged today. For my show and myself. And if people don't understand that or respect that, then they don't need to be here, you know, playing with me and doing stuff like that. Oh, I know, that's the thing. Like, I, I literally, like, hit the end of the show button and was like, ooh, I gotta go. I saw the UPS there. But my assistant got it, and I didn't have to go to it. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's an interesting. Like, people get offended and pissed off at me because I don't, like, let them play with me instantaneously, you know? Um, for whatever reason. or You know, I don't know. I don't know you guys, all you guys that well. A lot of you are brand new followers that I haven't got to talk to and play with for, you know months on end like I have with a lot of my other followers Did you forget? and Geek Ronin. Um, so, you know, a lot of times I feel like I repeat what I talk about, but I think it's important. When you have new followers on a show, uh, it's important. Because, you know, I'm not saying this in a bad way because I fucking love Tally. I'm a subscriber. I am part of the Hammer Squad. Hammer's up! But... You know, being that he's one of the biggest streamers on Twitch. And I say that because not only is he just consistently rocking it, consistently doing good, he plays all different kinds of games. He tries his best to be an all-around host. You know? You have some people that, like, only play World of Warcraft, only play League of Legends, only play Counter-Strike, only play DayZ, uh, for whatever reason. Some people that might play one game and then switch over to... A new game you know like oh destiny's out i'm going to play destiny for a week and then switch back to my games um tally always is like plays the games he wants to play tries to play all the new games you know he's amazon sponsored so he has to do the amazon spiel but the man i have will always have my respect and i you know I, that's the thing is i love and watch a lot of streamers i watch some bad streamers just so i can know what not to do um, but you, what we have here in the Twitch verse is what we call, you know, ghost followers. People that come in and they follow you, they get on your friends list, and that's it. They'll never be back in your show. They might pop in if you ignore them to say, hey, why aren't you, like, playing with me or something. Um, and then, you know, there's also what we Twitch streamers that, you know, talk about is the, think they're Twitch streamer viewers. Uh, we don't really have a name for those people. Um, wannabes. People that basically pop into a, a stream, you know, whether it's got a thousand people, a hundred people, or five. And they do the stupid shit like, I'm the only one here. You only have two viewers. You know? Things like that. <laughs> Wait. You...
done your challenge you were just trying to do, or you've done what I was just talking about. <laughs> <coughs> oh, sorry for cough. Sorry, sorry. Now that my microphone is on my headset, I really hate when I cough into it. Sorry, I do apologize, everyone. I hope the sound volume is okay. Uh, Destiny has such overpowering sound, I had to, like, turn my broadcast software version of it down. You know, people that come in and they don't have the patience to go join our crew. They don't have the technology to join our crew and they get all pissed off. You know, impatience is the greatest virtue of all and it is a major virtue with any Twitch streamer. I mean, you go into a mega show, Summit, Towley, Voodoo Shuffler, um, Duck Sauce, Soda Poppin, Lyric, where they have a thousand to five thousand people talking. Uh, people go into the chat and they don't expect the streamer to like BFF them in five seconds and like converse back and forth. But then people pop into a stream with like five, ten, two, and they expect the streamer to be like, oh my god, you're my only viewer. I'm going to talk to you nonstop, play whatever game you want, do whatever you want, invite you in. Sorry, boys and girls. You do that, you end up becoming a hollow shell of a streamer. And you're basically an unpaid whore. If people want to donate five bucks, I'll play whatever game they want with them. And I'll even, like, touch myself while I do it. But you got to, to quote Lethal Frag, one of my favorite streamers, even though I don't like any of the games he plays, really, I give him mad respect for the beer, for the tattoos, for the patience, the virtue, the knowledge, and the fact that he's even popped in here and watched my show. Um, because I sent him a tweet that was like, thank you so much for paving the way for everyone. But like I said, you know, some people just stream from their PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and PC. They don't really put time and effort into it. You know, they just want to be able to say, hey, I'm a streamer, you know, watch me. To me, it's about viewers so I can re reach partnership. Once I reach partnership, I will have a $500 a month budget to give stuff away on the show. Every month I want to try to give away a PlayStation 4. Uh, every month I want to try to give away, every other month I want to try to give away a brand new computer. Uh, good enough to not only game on, but stream with. And people that follow and view and win those things, add them to our streaming thing. But you know, it's, it's interesting because a lot of people, they'll stream, but they don't bother interacting with anyone. And they're like, oh, streaming's really easy. It takes a lot to get up 7 o'clock every morning, five to six days a week, and stand or sit for seven to 10 hours a day. During the summer, I was doing like 15 hour shows. While you're dealing with technology management, and you're dealing with assholes and trolls, and you're trying to deal with like talking to people, it can be very taxing. A lot of people get burnt out and frustrated because they don't have instant partnership or something. You should get GTA 5. Although, Godzilla, if you plan on getting on next-gen consoles, you may want to wait and get it on the PS4. But, for all of us playing on the PS3, all of your stats carry over. Just like in Destiny. If you guys are playing Destiny on the PS3, don't forget, when you get it on the PS4, it just carries right over. Hey, old. I mean, in case that guy Joe, Joe came in. It was probably Joe Burke. He's a 10, 12 year old from the UK. He's a glitcher duper. We caught him and, and this girl named Shorty, this little Ewok looking chick from fucking the UK. They were both duping vehicles for money in the game. We kicked him out of the crew, we kicked him out of the show. And he has continually trolled this show. He makes like a fake account and tries to follow me and come in and start shit like once a week. Um, so when people come in and they're named Joe and they start shit, like if I were to go over to, to Joe, that guy right now, I guarantee he's probably following zero people. I bet his Twitch account was activated today. Um, oh, look at all my nice cars. But you know what? It's all about Susan. I love Susan. Susan's my car.
people that are willing to stay here and hang out, like the real easy A, that gentleman, Alex, he has followed me for months. He will watch me and moderate with me, even when he's not able to play the game with me, hours after he, he can't play. There's a reason why he is the right-hand man on the show. There's a reason why he's the most senior moderator, why he is the moderator's moderator. He is, you know, an editor. He is the number one. Uh, it's because he's willing to stay in there, you know, even though he might not be able to play with me, he'll stay in the chat as best he can and, and deal with stuff. You know, like I said, people that come, people that don't, are, haven't been watching the show, minus Hacksaw, I don't know why. Uh, Hacksaw actually has been watching the show, he just can't type in his, his chat, but people that haven't been, like, watching the show or playing with me because they don't have Destiny, and if I see them pop back in here tomorrow, the second I'm playing Minecraft, moderators or not, I'm not gonna be too happy. You know what I mean? Now, everyone has a right to do that. Do not get me wrong. People have a right to say, I'm busy, I want to watch somebody else, I want to play somebody else. But sometimes you can tell the behavior is kind of like, if I can't be seen on the show, I can't stream, so I want to star on another streamer's show. Great. Please. As I put it all the time, you guys are all stars on my show. I'm a director, these are my movies, you guys are stars and actors and actresses. Please, please, please. I don't know. I feel like I'm on a little rant right now. Which is partially, you know, what I'm allowed to do. Now here's where it's funny. Here's where Joe was full of shit. Joe was just trying to start shit. Joe was probably Joe Burke, a.k.a. Iron Payback, a.k.a. a hacking troll, the cancer of gaming. And I say that knowing that he's a kid, but man, fucking... What goddamn parent buys their fucking 13-year-old this game and leaves them alone to do whatever they want? Unobserved. Ugh. But anyways. You know the <laughs> I'm waiting for hookers. Yeah, I don't know. Like I said, it's a common it's a it's a common issue with gaming and streaming. It's the white elephant in the room, uh, up there with like hackers and glitchers. Um, thank you. Is you know dealing with it. It's it's a sticky wicket. I like to talk about it because we have a lot of people. We've had people coming to follow my show who I've helped become streamers who I now like stream on our network channel. Uh, so to me, I I want to help. You know, Twitch. I'm in the same city as Twitch. I want to reach partnership with this channel as well as my others. Um, you know, our YouTube channel, our MG4. I could be a streamer that just sits back and quietly plays. Occasionally looks at my chat. Talks to people if I want to talk to them. But I don't. I try to interact with everyone. I try to play with everyone. I try to find a compromise to please everyone. But I have to make sure I please myself. Because then I won't want to get up tomorrow and do it if I'm frustrated. And I've been there. A few months in, I was about to shut it all down. You know? But we are currently in the top 10 world GTA streamers. We're still in the top three GTA streamers. We are still the number one PS3 Destiny streamer, the number one Battlefield 3 streamer, the number one Far Cry 3 streamer, the number one Fallout 3 streamer, the number one Borderlands 2 streamer, number one Skyrim on the PS3 streamer, and the number one and only Red Dead Redemption streamer. And currently in the top 1,500 streamers on topstreamers.com, which really doesn't matter because I don't know what's up with that fucking website right now. Uh, and honestly, I think it's about to get shut down because it's not... It's like rebroadcasting our streams without, like, any support or anything. <sighs> Yo, Briggsy, what's up? <laughs> 